MJF Shapiro, just like those three letters. Brash, cocky, and arrogant. Your type of person, huh? He is one of the top tier talents in professional wrestling, and the fact that it took him this long to get here to House of Glory is ridiculous. But you know what? This one is a match to watch. I have been looking forward to this since they announced it, cause it's gonna be a barn burner. Continuously about how he's taking his own opportunities. Oh, now we want, now we want to handshake Shapiro. Look at this guy. He's a professional. He's respectful. Cody Rhodes chose him to be all in. There you go. Fetch top by cash flow. Lighten MJF up. Snap neck man. Goes for that currency kick, and MJF had that one well scouted. Gets out of harm's way. Smart move by Friedman going to the outside. MJF back in the ring. MJF has made the most of every opportunity put in front of him. That's a smart move there. There's that uh, another opportunity. Raising his arms up like his new best buddy, Stone Cold Steve Austin. And you gotta wonder if Ken Broadway really thinks that MJF is taking his opportunities. Listen, Shapiro, I had the opportunity to interview MJF when I was at All In. I was at StarCast on Podcast Row. And he said he hates the letters H-O-G. Oh my God, what a big boot by Cashflow. MJF again rolls out of the way, Cashflow. So I see the through the ropes. Takes out the cocky MJF. 
But Broadway, feeling himself a little too much, JD, needs to go and stay on MJF, whether or not you like him. His pedigree, he's held championships in other companies at the level of Hog. He's the MLW middleweight champion. Look at this guy, my goodness. He was making I see why you like him. Zeno jumped in the way, how dare you? What an elbow by MJF. Wow, oh my goodness. Castle just went right into the steel post. MJF Shapiro says he hates the letters H-O-G and what they stand for. Said he reached out to Brian XL to be a part of House of Glory and Brian ignored his phone call. Well, you know what? There might be a bit of trepidation there. You've got a character and a personality like MJF. He brings a lot to the table, but he also, and this is me saying this, doesn't know when to shut up. And he's used that to his advantage. He's talked himself into every major chance he's had. He said Brian did not want him to perform inside a House of Glory ring because he would simply embarrass Brian and Red's quote unquote students. Well, Ken Broadway, a prodigy inside the ring, right now being shown up here by the Long Island native. Has right on to the wrist. MJF stomping on the wrist there. Cashflow, Ken Broadway. Cashflow had a battle with Austin Aries, the Impact World Heavyweight Champion at High Intensity 7. There's nothing you can take away from Ken Broadway. Former champion here in House of Glory, holding the Crown Jewel Championship. A top level athlete. He is currently Mr. Break the Glass Ceiling. He's even contemplated and stated publicly that he is looking to cash in on Anthony Gangon right now, who is injured, looking to make the most of his opportunity as he's trying to fight out of this one here. Knife edge shot by Cashflow. Broadway, ever the opportunist, has found himself, was handed the House of Glory Crown Jewel title. Almost tore the shoulder off of Cam Broadway. Two count there. Uh, I don't know if your boy can count, Shapiro. No, that, two count. no, no, that should have been three, but the continuously corrupt Louis Zeno Jr. counting slow. He also looks disheveled. Looks like Pampero Furpo. MJF now perching Broadway on the top turnbuckle. Broadway with that stiff elbow there. MJF returning the favor. Some words there for cash flow by MJF as Broadway's trying to fight out of this off the top turnbuckle headbutt. Rocks MJF. Ascending to the top. Time for the Missile drop kick. But that arm, Shapiro, MJF has done damage to that left arm of Cashflow. You can take away a lot of Broadway's offense by injuring that shoulder, making his range of motion minimized. The Elks Lodge here addressing MJF by his first name as he goes down to a flurry of offense here by Cashlow. Go. And shoulder. that arm again. Trying to dislocate it there. Here comes Friedman. Step up and Seguri into the backstabber. Vintage Broadway goes for the cover. And MJF kicks out. Wasn't able to get a full cover there. Still trying to nestle that shoulder, nestle that arm, and left enough room for Friedman to get either shoulder up. I think he tried to throw it a little bit at Broadway to get that inside up. Broadway now measuring him. MJF moves out of the way. Nice move there as Broadway hits the turnbuckle. Friedman, a former collegiate football player. Decided to transition from football to wrestling. Oh my God! 
trying what to... What a move by, by MJF. Shapiro, these people might not like him, but he's wrestling a great match here tonight. Showing some great ring acumen there. Going for the snap mare with the arm hooked. Cover. Working on that shoulder, putting pressure. If he puts pressure on the opposite shoulder on the cover, even if Broadway kicks out, that's still putting torque in that shoulder, that's still putting a lot of effort there and causing more strain. So either way, Friedman has the advantage here over Broadway, especially when it's on the ground. MJF only 23 years old, one of the brightest prospects right now in the industry. An incredible future awaits him. It's Broadway now. Well, that elbow. And these two blue chippers now just going back and forth. Broadway off the ropes. Oh my God! Oh my! And look at the look on Friedman's face. He loves it. Cock short. Shapiro. He's the king of the eye poke. I don't know if you guys seen Friedman's uh, hand gesture. He said he was number one. Oh, I see that. Double clothesline. That just shows you how evenly matched both competitors are here. Chapter three, MJF, a first time ever here in House of Glory. Against cash flow. Ken Broadway now crawling over to possibly make the cover here. Trying to at least break the count, cover! And he does! And MJF, look at that! Transitions into an armbar! Has it locked in! Great positioning by Friedman! But Broadway, long limbs, long arms, long legs, being able to muscle over, but a bow and arrow! Oh my god! Broadway, nowhere to go! The foot right in the middle of the back of Broadway and it gets to Rose. Unbelievable. MJF backs away as if he can't believe it. Ranger in Broadway now. Look at us, look at us, look at us. There it is. He's got it.